My name's Sophie Young, I'm 19 and I'm from Burntwood. Ever since I was younger, I've always had an enthusiasm for making things and putting stuff together. I've always had an enthusiasm for science and maths and I wanted to find a career that enabled me to actually bring those two things together. I really enjoyed my time at school but I think it got to a point where I was just finishing my A-levels where I thought I wanted to still learn things but do it in a different environment. I think it's really important with a career like engineering to actually get that practical experience. My role at the moment is electrical production engineer. I will do engineering drawing, schematics, help out with people on the shop floor and answer general engineering queries. The company that I work for, PP Control and Automation, are an outsourcing company for control panels. We can manufacture anything from CNC machines to X-ray machines and we do the brains of the machine in a sense, so everything that controls what that machine will do. The machine that you can see here is a food separation machine. During the first six months of my apprenticeship, I spent some time on the shop floor doing production jobs such as the one here. Doing this hands-on part of the role was something that was really important to me because during my time at school, I never got that hands-on experience. It's really helped me to develop my knowledge and understanding of the design processes that we carry out in our engineering offices. Now I get that understanding of how my knowledge can actually be turned into something practical. The process that I now follow now I'm in the engineering offices full-time is a process from taking the customs information into something that is ready for production. This is an example of something that we'd received. So it's a, a simple drawing that um, someone has sketched out. We use a 3D software and 2D software to develop our designs. And then eventually, as you can see here, a full layout and all the references that the shop floor will need to build the information. Growing up, I always saw engineering as being like a dirty factory environment with cars and machines. Our factory in particular is a really clean one and it's a really nice manufacturing environment. I've met other engineers and they definitely agree with me that there's kind of a stigma around what engineering really is. End of last year, I was involved in an engineering conference for Women in Engineering Day. It involved speaking to a, a wide range of people on a live conference about my experience as a, as a female in engineering. As a female in the industry, I definitely thought that I was going to feel a little bit left out in my department or not really feel that included, but that really isn't the case. Everyone that I work with has made me feel really included and really comfortable and they treat me just like how they treat each other. The advantages for doing this apprenticeship are definitely the qualifications that I get out of it in such a short amount of time. I get a HNC in electrical engineering, a foundation degree. That's only taking me four and a half years as opposed to the three years at university. I definitely want to stay in engineering. It's a brilliant industry to progress and I'd like to reach senior engineer status and possibly develop into management. I really do love my job. I think it's it's been great for me so far. I've had so many opportunities. I feel like I'm part of a family here, and that's quite cliche to say.